Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today, I have double Chanel unboxings as you can see in uh, my the title of my video below. So I'll just go straight into it. And I know it's been a while, but I went um, shopping today. So I decided to get two items from Chanel. So I'll start with the smaller item first. Uh, as usual, the black paper bag with the bow and um, the camellia. So I got this from KLCC in Kuala Lumpur so that's the only place with a Chanel boutique I'm just trying to undo the bowl it's quite difficult so oh actually I can take the box out so uh, the box I think you know what it is this is a pair of shoes it's so cute with the camellia um, my SA is really nice so you should look for her if you ever go to Chanel KLCC to get your uh, Chanel fix so I just got something that I can wear a lot I think uh, so it comes with the booklet, dust bag, and wrapped nicely in tissue paper. I've got pink ballerina flats. They are fuchsia and I'm wearing size uh, 39, 39C. So I've got quite large feet. And yeah, they're so pretty. I wanted to get the coral ones, but there were no more um, new ones for the coral ones. So I didn't want to wear like, um, you know, stuff, uh, shoes that others have tried many times. So I decided to get the pink. So they are really cute. I plan to wear them a lot. Um, and because they are round toe, it's actually quite um, comfortable. They're quite good for my feet. So yeah, this is the first item. And now for the heavier item, I think you can guess what this is from the size and the box. Yes, I did get a Chanel bag um, today and let me unbox it right away. Belle is looking at me. She's quite interested in bags, I think. So, wow. Oops. Big. To be honest, it was really heavy uh, carrying it around. So, I went to collect it later. After a while, I couldn't take it. So here's the bag. Um, she gave me the magnetic box as well, which is great. And so unfortunately, I had to untie this. You know, it's quite difficult to tie this bow. So I always admire how they can do it so easily. I think they're used to it. And can you guess what I got? So it's something that I think is quite practical and I've been wanting for a long time. So. That's nice tissue paper wrapped up. I guess I'll need to tear it. Yeah. Go. And here it is. It's my new Coco Hello bag in the medium size. I'm going to use it for work. It is a chevron as you can see in royal blue, I think. Let me put the box away, Bill. Here it is. I'm so happy I got this bag. It has silver hardware as you can see. Four feet which makes it very practical and it's in sturdy calf leather. And you know, it has the outer back pocket like the classic flaps. Um, you know, this compared to the classic flap, right, it's a much more... Um, uh, this bag is actually very worth it in terms of the pricing compared to the Chanel Classic flap because it still has the classic look. You know, it has a shoulder strap. Uh, let me unwrap it. Um, and at the same time, you know, it's uh, almost half the price of the Classic flap. So I think it's really, really a uh, good buy. You know, if you want to, if you like the look of Coco handles, I think you should get it soon because I heard that they might increase the price of Coco handles very soon because. Chanel is going to realize that it is a very, you know, worth it bag compared to its other designs because that's what they just did for the Gabriel bag. So it comes with this shoulder strap which is going to make it very convenient. And here's um, the black felt piece and stuffing. So it actually has two, uh, three compartments inside. Let me show you three main ones. Uh, one zipper one in the middle okay so it's lined in fabric so i think that is also a reason for the lower cost one two three and then there are um, a few pockets here like the classic with a lipstick pocket here and then 
uh, here there's yet another zippered compartment uh, whereas here in the middle there's a, a smaller zippered compartment um, it's quite small so maybe you can keep some cash things like that so I'm really really glad I got this bag I think pricing is gonna go up soon for this so if you want a um, cocoa handle you should definitely get one soon I'm gonna remove the stickers because I don't like the look so yeah and also the strap is detachable so you can actually have it on your arm if you wish so now I'm just gonna like um, uh, transfer some of my stuff into the bag so I went out today uh, with my friend Rosa and then she accompanied me to get it it was really fun so here's my, uh, my compact um, the Dior and then uh, keys and um, my Chanel wallet which I also got from the same SA her name is Cecilia she's really nice and knowledgeable my LV clay the uh, steadfast one uh, my Chanel card holder, which I haven't changed since ages ago. Uh, lipstick, my Givenchy lip balm, which I really like. And then what can I put in the middle? I'm tissue paper, I've been using so much. I always need my charger. Oh, I got Sorry, it's so messy. Yep, and If I want to put a little, um, small little calculator, so this is how the bag looks stuffed up. Wow, it's quite heavy, honestly, but definitely not as heavy as the Antigona. So I'm really, really in love with this bag. So happy I finally decided to get it, and I got it in this color because I think it's not as boring as, I mean, black is always classic, but you know I have a lot of black bags, so it's not as so-called boring as a black bag, but. You know, yet yeah, it's not light coloured, so it's perfect for me. I think it's a bit short if you wear it crossbody. It looks a bit strange, but I think it's still doable. And this is more of a work bag for me, a daily bag, so it's not really like going out bag. So I think this is quite a practical, sturdy work bag. So yeah, I can't wait to use this bag um, on my business trip. I think that's coming up again. So yeah, I uh, hope you enjoyed my unboxings today guys and I'm actually going to sell my uh, Givenchy Antigona bag. So if you're interested, please do um, send me an email. So And guys, um, thanks for watching. Bye! Hi everyone, so now I'm in Pullman Kuching um, Hotel and this is going to be my home for I think the next two weeks and I wanted to take advantage of the full-length mirror here just to show my outfit. I'm wearing a Zara dress, simple with my Tory Burch um, flat shoes and my latest bag, the Coco Handle in um, Royal Blue Chevron is really really pretty and I really really love it and I think it's going to serve me really well um, I plan to use it quite a lot, I'm on a business trip and I think the hardy leather would definitely help so it fits very well in the crook of my arm as you can see just now it looks on the shoulder so I need to take a look I think it's the right length for a shoulder bag and if I do it um, crossbody, it's kind of short but anyway, this is how the bag looks it's stuffed up and there's a bathroom with, nice, um, with a tub which I always like and here I think you can actually see let me step in to the tub and you can see um, the uh, V 
view outside, so it's really pretty. So, yeah, this is where I'm going to be for the next two weeks. And, yep, yeah, so I hope you like this little intro. And this bag is really going to be really useful. So, yeah, that's how I'm justifying it. you guys that I bought. Um, Chanel perfume at the airport. Uh, this is Chance. This is EDT, so it's lighter and it's a very nice. Um, it has a vaporizer. It's a per spray. Uh, it has two refills inside. Let's take a look. The vaporizer. Um, oh, and then that's the spray. So, yeah. So. That's it guys, I hope you like this little room tour, very, it's not a huge thing, but of course, my latest addition to my collection. Thanks for watching, and just to show you the um, night view, really pretty, the bridge, and the, that's the parliament of the state parliament, the dune, and that's the Sarawak river, you can see that's the bridge, the Hornbill bridge, and yeah, so... Good night everyone, bye.